guys and welcome to the first episode of the new year 2022 I'd like to thank everyone for their support during 2021 and the channel's still pretty new compared to youtube standards so um i hope you all had an amazing christmas and a happy and a, and a good new year and all that um so today i'm going to review the three bags that i own um we're going to start off with the cheapest, which is the Avalon Classic First, which retails at $29.99. Then we're going to compare that to the Legend XT720, which is £42.50. And then you've got the Avalon Classic Archery Backpack, which is £44.50. Um, you've already seen me do a review on the um, Avalon Classic and the Legend XT. Um, this is a little bag I picked up for my son's bow uh, to store his equipment in. It's only a kid's bow. It fits in, just about fits in. He's got two little arrows, a little arm guard, finger tab. Uh, and a little quiver um, you know so that's just the right size for his his little kit it does have more with it you know you, there is an arrow tube that goes with it that he could put his arrows in but it, he's only got two so I just store them inside the bag um, in his little quiver plenty of room for that um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through each bag that I've got show you their features and for the price and out of the three um, which one I would pick uh, which which one I would recommend out of all of them um, you know they've all got their own different little features that um, that make them, you know, a little bit different, but it all depends on how much you want to spend. You know, I mean, if you've got a spare 50 quid, you know, about 45 quid, and you want the best you can get for 45 quid, I'd be going for the XT, Legend XT 720 all day long. If you've got a, if you've only got a small budget, not thirty quid, you know, then this isn't going to do you wrong. You know, it's a, it's a more than capable bag, but you just don't get the same level of protection that you will from the XT or the Avalon Classic bag. You know, these are. Well, as you can see, that that's the width of that one. That's the width of that one, you know. So you're going to get slightly more protection with a bigger bag. But, you know, if you're careful and, and you, you know, you handle it with care, then, yeah, this, this will do the job. So starting off with this one, which is the Avalon Classic First. This, like I said, this one is $29.99. So it comes with an over-the-shoulder handle, like so. It's also got a carry handle. Easy to carry like that. It's got a nice, nice and simple shoulder pad, and you can extend, extend that. To be a little bit longer opening it up it opens up fully like so and that's the top end moving on to the inside then you've got a full length got a full length thin 
mesh pocket here. Bring it in a little bit closer. All right, so you've got a two inch thick mesh pocket here. Just the right size for your arm guard. Like so. There's your arm guard. And then moving on into the center, you've got a couple of pockets here for your limbs. And you've got an open pocket here for your handle. Moving on to into the middle, you've got a couple of mesh pockets here to house your, your height, your um, parts of your sight. And then you've got a couple of uh, bungee cord uh, holders there for your, the body of your sight. You've got a couple of Velcro straps here with bungees again, so that would actually be for your sight, that one because it's got the Velcro on it. These would probably hold a couple of arrows in it, nice and firmly. And um, that is about it for this one. Um, so yeah, that's you know that's all, all the storage you've got in this one. And you've got a couple of Velcro hoops here for various different items. Okay, so that's pretty much everything on this one that you've got storage-wise. Again, I said, you know, like I said it is twenty nine ninety nine, and you know, does offer you a good, goodish level of protection. It's also got the hoops here for your arrow tube, so you can secure that nice and tightly. And then when you stick it on the shoulder. Like so, it sits quite nicely at hip level. I have got that fully extended to fit my body requirements. Okay, so that is how it will fit. Nice, nice and comfortable. Not too much restrictions. Yeah, for twenty nine ninety nine, you can't go wrong if it's what you can afford at the time. More than adequate, you know. Like I said, I bought this one for my son's kit, and it uh, it houses his equipment no problems whatsoever, whatsoever. So this is the Avalon Classic First. Okay, so that's that one. Now, moving on to the next most expensive, which is the Legend XT Seven Twenty. Uh, I have done a full length review on this one uh, on my channel as well. So if you want a more in-depth um, review, go and check that out. Now, this is the Legend XT 720. It's got the colour-coded arrow tube. Um, it's got the nice and padded backpack uh, straps. It's also got the little strap connectors that you can connect together when you're wearing it. Uh, again, more than adequate and comfortable. Um, I've used them a few times. Okay, got a nice carry handle here and it's got a nice padded carry handle here. On the back then, you've got like this breathable mesh and that, again, is nice and comfortable. You've also got the colour coded inner straps. Going on to the front, then you've got the Legend XT720 image. You've got the reflected strap, uh, reflective honeycomb pattern on there, which makes it reflective to light. Uh, and you know, the colour tabs. Zips are colour coded, and you've also got a little screen there where you can put name card and stuff like that. Okay, 
easy to extract the um, arrow tube. Just undo the toggle, and then we're going to move inside briefly to the storage. So inside here, as you can see, I've got a string. I've got my string. I've got my Avalon sight case. I've then got a little bag of tools, which I keep in the bottom pocket just there. Put them back in. I've then got my sights, which fit quite nicely there. Get that to do back up. In here, the top bit, I've got a part of my sight. And in this one, just a few Allen keys that, you know, you need Allen keys for pretty much everything to do, anything to do with archery. All right, so let's do that one up. Move into the bigger pocket then. Let's open that. All right, you've got quite a large pocket there that you can put your targets in stuff like that you know that's quite a handy pocket and then moving on the inside here you've got the mesh there for your arrow tube and then you've got a good size padded bag with two sections in it for your limbs and your handle or razor whichever you want to call it and then so yeah like I said this is 42.50 and it's the second most expensive bag I've got. So yeah, that's that's that one. Does help if I do the right pocket up. And we'll insert the arrow tube back in. Right, so that's case number two. All right, moving on to the most expensive bag. All right, the Avalon Classic at £44.50. All right. So, now, you do get a little bit more storage with this one. Just a little bit. Okay. So, again, right, honeycomb pattern on the front more honeycomb coverage with this one than the legend xt so it would be more reflective if you're walking along the road uh, at night now going into the first pocket let's cover the handles first again you've got a nice a nice padded handle here and an arrow tube here so again, we'll take the arrow tube out. Um, on the backpack, on the back of the backpack, reflective strips, but the reflective strips are on the inside, so when they're on your back, they're not going to be seen. Okay, so not the best. The straps are straight black. It would have been nice if the straps were green on the outside um green on the inside color coded but they're not nice little carry handle here and then avalon archery on the back moving around to the front you've got a zip here which goes halfway around the top to access your equipment from the top coming to the front You've got a large zipper at the front. Again, housing, this houses sights. But with this zip, as you can see, it doesn't go all to all the way to the bottom. 
like the Legend XT does. So to get your stuff out, you've actually got to dig deep inside. Again, there's a site in there. This one's made by Cartel. Uh, the knocking, ruler, knocking Point Ruler. And, you know, it's a decent size. You know, there's multiple storage pockets in there. There's my set of Allen keys. These are a cheap set of Allen keys from Poundland. Um, you know, you can get specific Allen keys from an archery shop, but I find just a cheap set from Poundland or a hardware store will do the job perfectly, perfectly well. I think these cost me about a pound, two pound maybe, and they're, they're, they've got every size Allen key going. So, that's them. They're actually made by Rolson. R O L S O N. Rolson. Perfectly adequate for, for doing what you do, what you need them for. Right? And so then we've got cases, um, gloves, uh, archery gloves. These are fairly cheap as well, $5.99 off eBay. And he drops the bag so you know that's a decent sized pocket that you can fit a lot of stuff in but it would have been nice if the zip went all the way to the bottom as you can see there's a big gap there going on to the larger pocket then and you have to undo this to undo undo that bag okay whereas on the whereas on the legend xt you can still leave your handle done up and undo the front big pocket but with the Avalon Classic, if you want to undo the front pocket, the main front pocket, you have to undo the handle because part of it is on the part where the zip is, the, where the pocket is. If they'd have made it so it was here instead of on the pocket here, you could still leave your handle done up and access your pocket. It's, I feel, find it a little bit awkward trying to undo things and then you've got a handle in the way to for your shooting, right? So anyway, going into the main bagging area, right? There's my quiver, which has got two storage pockets on it. That fits nicely on your on, on my belt. Okay. And then you've got the big area then for the case that holds your equipment. Now this has got three storage pocket uh, pockets on it instead of two. Right? And again it's got a tube and an extra tube in there for the arrow tube, right? So it's, you know, it's a, it's a very good bag. It's got plenty of storage, adequate to fit all your kit in. And, you know, it is a comfy bag. Like I said, the handle, situation you do have to undo it before you can open that zip and it you know it, it is a little bit fiddly but saying that it is a really really good bag so got the two bags 
side by side. Legend XT720, Avalon Classic, Archery Backpack. There's two pound difference between the two. 42.50, no, 44.50, 42.50. Now, personally, I would go for this one, the Legend XT, because it's the quirky little things that make the difference for me. The colour coded arrow tube is, is one. The comfort of the backpack is way better. It's, this, is, this is comfortable, but it's not as comfortable as this. The handle situation, you can leave it done up and you can still access all your pockets. And it's, yeah, it's not as, what am I trying to say? The orange, yes, is quite loud, but the contrast between the orange, the black, the grey is is really nice whereas with the legend with the avalon classic it's black loads of green a little bit of black at the bottom with the white writing it's really in your face i mean if you had a brighter color than that like a, a white or a, a red or um, i think they do do an orange as well um it's really in your face um and it's it's quite overpowering whereas this is Yes, it's bright orange, but it's quite, it's quite, the contrast is really nice. You know, you've got to, um, so personally, out of the two, I would be going for the Legend XT. It's a couple of quid cheaper. And, you know, so, yeah, that's what, that's what, that would be my main choice. If I couldn't get my hands on one of these, I would definitely recommend buying one of these. You know, like I said, they are comfortable. You do get slightly more storage, but for the extra two quid, it's not gonna break the bank. So these are the two that I would definitely highly recommend. I would recommend as well, the Avalon First, Classic First. Good bag, very good. Limited on storage, they could have put an extra couple of pockets in there maybe, but then again, it's going to still protect your kit to some extent if you drop it and stuff like that. You know, so if you've got the spare money, you know, the extra £12.50, definitely get a Legend XT. You know, if you can push it up, you know and or if there's no legend xts available then and you, could, you can afford a little bit more you definitely get an avalon classic backpack if you're short on funds and you just need something to protect your kit you know you can find it you can definitely get one of these and they're 30 well 29.99 they're 30 quid and it will do It'll protect your equipment enough till you can afford a better bag. Um, so, yeah, like I said, these are 30, these are 42.50, these are 44.50, and you know, they're all they all, all they are all very capable of protecting your equipment to some extent. Obviously, this one wouldn't protect your equipment as good as these two, but it will still protect your equipment. So this one, the Avalon Classic First and the Legend XT are from um, Wales Archery and the Avalon Archery Classic Backpack, that's from Bow Sports, but this is also available at Wales Archery and the prices I'm quoting you for these bags are off the Wales Archery website. Okay. 
So that's the three bags. Please like, share and subscribe uh, and do all that fancy good stuff. Um, and yeah, hopefully this year we can hit 100 subscribers and anything after that will be a massive bonus. Um, like I said, everything, every, videos will be fortnightly. Uh, I am halfway there to saving up for the for the new bow that I want to bring in, um, which is uh, I won't say any what name it what what it is, but it's slightly more expensive than the stuff I've currently got. And then I will be selling one of the the bows on eBay. So I'll put you know. When that goes on sale, I'll let you know if anyone on the, any of the subscribers want to buy it. Head on over there and you can buy it. So, yeah, that's the three bags. They all do a good function. So, yeah, like I said, please like, share and subscribe and all that good stuff. And uh, I'll catch you in the next one, which will be two weeks today. So, anyway, guys, have a good one and I'll catch you later. Take it easy.